All right, welcome back everyone to Vamp here. Last time, we figured out what the uh, source of the plague was, and we put an end to it. We brought the curtain down on the uh, on the theatrical plague spreader. And now we are here in our home, I believe. Yes. Somebody help me. What? Someone just said somebody help me. Who just said that? It won't be you. We have got quest markers around, to be honest. I have completely forgotten what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> anyway, a surprise for the London Lone Gourmet is the current subquest we've got going on. I have forgotten all of the buttons because we haven't played this in about four weeks. So, let's test it on this enemy, which I believe to be a pain in the arsehole. I've got my hatchet on. Oh shit. Oh yeah, I forgot, they, uh, they explode when they die. Oh shit, pissing dicks. I forgot that that fucking locks onto you like no, no, no one's business. Oh wow, I might actually die here. In fact, I'm going to. That locks onto you like a bastard, doesn't it? Oh good. Oh, you're you're getting stuck in now, are you? Excellent. Yeah, fucking love that. Oh, I am getting fucking trolleyed here. Welcome back to the game, dickhead. I guess. I've got no blood left. He just shot me in the face. <laughs> oh, good. Good. So, that was a thing that happened. We've forgotten all of the buttons. All of them. I've roughly worked out that X is attack, Y is your sort of big attack or stun, if you have a stun thing. Oh good. It started us right here. This is no place for you, sir. Yeah, I uh I said go back home. I'm going back home, you bastard. Piss off. I'm trying to work out how to change my buddy weapons. Right, there you go, left. Okay. I need to change from the shotgun to a stun weapon. There we go. I do have a stun weapon. That drains 30 stun. That's 41 stun. That's even better. Um. Yeah, I think that's the one. That is the one. Yeah, nice. Right, what was I going to do? I was going to stun this guy and get his uh, his blood out. There he is. Wondering where he went then. All right, mate. I'm going to take your blood, motherfucker. Oh, good. Why can I not dodge? Why can I not dodge? I just don't understand why I can't dodge. Like, I am pressing the right button for it. I'm like, oh, no, I'm not. That's why I was pressing A, not B. And then I didn't have any stamina left. And then I started doing an attack when I needed to block to, do, to dodge. There you go. I need some stamina, to be honest. So we need some stamina. We're remembering all of the buttons, it's great. Can't see a thing. Right, we've got a lot of blood, that's good. Cool. <laughs> okay, we've, we've remembered how to fight now, this is good. So, where were we? Yes. So we've just figured out um, that the theater was the source of the boobs indeed was the source of the infection and we dealt with it 
We are now doing some side quests for the people that we met last time. The Gourmet of London. And I just pressed a button accidentally whilst I was reorganising my... my shit. Right, so, the Gourmet wants us to find a good place to eat. Or some good food. So, we're right near one here. So we need to find a surprise for the Gourmet. I'm assuming it's going to be a ground level. Maybe something in the market. Maybe something in here. I think this is my this Fresh is the house water. I started in. As long as it's not holy water, I may find some use for it. Hmm, I just found something new, I think. This might be it actually. In fact that might be the quest item that I'm after. So I can't get through this door. Okay. No, I'm still looking for something, apparently. So... Are we talking this way? Yeah. Something in this direction. The Gourmet wants. And of course, what the Gourmet wants, the Gourmet gets. We're trying to... Oh shit, the fuck? Where the fuck did you come from, you dickhead? Whoa, um, sorry. Oh, good. Oh, good. Right, you could absolutely... Wow. I can't fucking do anything to this guy. Wow, I, I can't block him. He is... Oh, he's got like a blood shield or some shit on. Right, now I'm doing some damage. Oh good, I am going to die here. This is, uh, unideal. This is unideal. Oh good. Oh, he's got the fucking shield on again. Oh damn it. Right, let's go with the... Oh, he's just cast it again. Yeah, that's great. Yeah, you, you, you do that, mate. Yeah, you, you go right the fuck ahead. Good. Good. What? Did that not even... Did that not even kick... Oh, my God. I'm going to die here. Oh, have all the enemies in the area just fucking buffed up now that we've progressed the fucking story a bit? Because I actually can't do anything. I actually cannot cope. Um, I don't have any shotgun bullets, so I can't do anything with that. Oh, good! There's no way. There's no way out. I'm dead. I'm done. I have no way to um, lock. Cool. Uh, right. I think we need to level up again. Um, we are struggling. The world's enemies have leveled up past me, and I need to catch up. Oh, we didn't even... Oh, my God. Turn around, sir. Yeah, I am turning around. Oh, shut your fucking mouth, you twat. I have had enough. <laughs> had enough of this shit. Oh, good. Oh, this guy's just fucking decided to fucking stick his oar in, right? Let's get Shotgun Boy involved. Right, let's... See if Shotgun Boy can help me out here. Oh, 
Let's see how long you'll be grinding. Yeah, exactly. Uh, would you fucking help me out with this fucking prick, please? Why are you attacking me, you fucking bellend? You know what? There you go. Oh, why are you going after me, you dickhead? Right! <laughs> uh, I've got 8,590 XP. I could go up a couple of levels, I think. There's no sprint button I know of. Right, I've already... I've just looted this place, haven't I? Right. So, it still counted my progress in terms of looting, but it, it respawned the enemies and it got rid of my blood. Sadly. Okay. Let's go in here. That guy was defending something, so I'm assuming... Oh, hello. Do I know you? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. Do you need help, sir? I think I'm fine. But what happened to my jailer? Be careful. He's as vicious as he is strong. Ooh. You don't have to worry about him anymore. What happened here? Oh, I am was Kadao that Kimura. the vampire outside? I was imprisoned by this lunatic for several days. I thought I was going to die here. You're not going to die now, Mr. Kimura. If you hurry, you should be able to get home safely. It seems that I owe you my life. You he said, all my he said some of that without moving his mouth. Since it is the most precious thing I possess. All right, cool. Uh, Goodbye, Mr. Kimura. Take care. I'll see you later, whoever you are, Mr. Kimura. Let's just uh, loot the place whilst we're here. We've just done a, done a quest we weren't even on, to be honest. The Heresy of Pure Blood. What's that say? Uh, what was this? Ah, there it is. The Heresy of the Pure Blood. Pure Blood. We know the expression. We heard it in the foul mouth of the heretics and the foreign barbarians used it sometimes ourselves. But um, do we really know what it means? A vampire born from an immortal belly? What a disgusting idea. Huh. So basically, it means vampires that are born, not created by embrace. All right. Um, you have a good one, mate. I'll see you later. Right. wonder why he was imprisoned by that fella. Mm-hmm. Alright, lads. How's it going? Oh, shit. Don't want to get those, those lot involved. I can one shot this fella. That's useful. Beautiful. Okay, so. Hmm, do I want to go in there? Is that going to be where the. Sorry, what? 
Yes. Track it, please. A surprise for the gourmet. Could be. Could be in there. The search area does include that. Yeah, I reckon it will be. It's it's a it's a market after all, isn't it? Kind of looks like Covent Garden. The Covent Garden market is uh, is a nice place. This is no place for you, sir. Sorry, mate. I'm just passing through, lad. Come on, you, you won't get me. You won't get me. Okay. See if we find something. We have a reflection. Not very vampiric, is it? Right, mate. Munched on, bitch. There we go. Right. Okay, apparently there's something here. Are the guys downstairs triggered? I think they are. I think the guys downstairs have been triggered. Something doesn't like me being here. Okay. So we've got dudes down there. we got... Something going on. I think we might have to uh, have a fight at some point. Hmm. China. China. Elegant women's clothing. Okay, so it's not going to be that. Ooh, hello. Rooting in the bins. Wakefield chocolate. Now we're talking. Food. Some sort of food item. Hmm. If I were looking for a food item for a gourmet, where would I... Find it. Maybe downstairs? It is a big chocolate house, isn't it? I've already opened that chest. Slash box. I might already have the thing. No, because it would have... Um, it would have confirmed we, we finished it, wouldn't it? Let's just murder these two. Three, actually, I think there's three of them. I'm just gonna, gonna chomp on this whilst he's doing that. Piss off. Fucking hell. Here we go. <laughs> Got him. No. Give me the health. Give me the health. I do hear some sort of gremlin having a, a little munch on something. It's not going to be in the ladies' tailor. Oh, hello. It's gremlins! Get the bed. Your mate's just like waiting for. Okay. Nom 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 nom. 
Right, there you go. Now I can have one on one with you. Piss off! I dodged. I pressed the fucking dodge button. There you go. Crikey. Right, so I think we've we've been through this uh, this market. We just we've confirmed there's nothing here. Nothing for the gourmet anyway. This market is free of gourmet things. Can we just find something in the bin? Nothing in the bin. We must feed the gourmet. No buildings here we can go in, really. I was supplied to him, the king. Can't go in there. Um, that's a hat store. There's some food items going on there, but the door is completely blacked out. Hmm. And we're now out of the area. Do we have to go in the park, do we think? Or do we reckon it's going to be in the little back back alley market area there? I don't know. It's not It's not going to be in the park, is it? We're just about to go past it, so might as well check. Hey, mate. Fuck, it's biting! He's dead! Eat this! I'd rather eat you, you dickhead! Why is it not working? I just pressed RB a bunch and it did not work. It's mildly irritating. Oh shit, something's attacking me, apparently. Oh, it's you. Hello. Don't mind me. Murdered him. There you go. Right, so... This is the bit in the park that's in the circle. Little car here. London News. It's not going to be the, for the gourmet, unless it's a back of the sweets. Um, fountain food? Is that a thing? That's a new stand there. Um, there is technically more further down. Come on then. Nom nom nom. Just about got out of that before she exploded. Cool, cool, cool. There's not going to be anything about, uh, in the bins. Not going to be anything in the public notice. Or anything in the cart? No? It's got to be in that market, hasn't it? It does. It's I forgot to be in the... Uh, Oh shit. I'll use some blood pointlessly there, but that's fine. It's I've got to be in the um, in the in the market. Indoor market or the alleyway at the back with the carts and stuff. Can't see another way. Nowhere else for it to be, is there? Wasn't it? Did I look up? Hmm. 
technically there's, there's ways up here, but I don't didn't see any doors. Didn't see any windows we could go in. Got to be in this market here. It absolutely must be. Is there some fish? There's some veg. There's some fish. I am not seeing it. This is the only house you can go in. How much did Kimura's probably just... Oh no, he's still there. Um, we've, had, we've searched this whole place, haven't we? Oh. Might be something through there. Maybe that's just on the other side of the wall. In the alleyway. Ooh, okay. So there's a hat store there. Uh, not any hat store, a gentleman's hat store. I will have you know. Okay. I am running out of ideas. Anything in here? There's no way to get through here. Can't see anything to pick up. We've already looted it. Hmm. Okay, I guess we're going to go to the next area, down this way. Although... That is the way to go, apparently. Let's go over this one. Um, so... Behind us, up that way. Where are we going? <laughs> so away from the park, and then take a left, and then take a right. Okay, so that's the way to the park. We go away from there. I can hear the trains going over the uh, the bridge that we're going to go under. Hopefully he hasn't respawned just here. He's not right. There's the bridge. Dead inside. Me too, mate. Me too. Never thought I'd... Uh... Feel bad for a door. Or identify with a door. So strongly. Right, we're back in Whitechapel. Choo choo. There's the chair train just gone. Okay, so we need to go down there. We're taking a wrong turn here. Yeah, we didn't actually want to go through that fence, I don't think. There's a way further down. Um, there's a way to the left through the gate. That's how there is. <laughs> I didn't see that. Oh, bloody hell. I have to have a fight here. It's unavoidable. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I've blocked. Right, I'm gonna need some blood in a second. The next enemy's getting stunned. So further on. Run. <laughs> Don't mind me, lads. Just passing through. Okay. So we take a left and then a right. So around here somewhere. 
Uh, it's a bloody Vulcud. Bloody Vulcud. Yeah, I'd rather fight a Vulcud than a. Uh... Let's see if I can sneak up on him. A sneaky attack. <laughs> Shit, I keep pressing A to try and dodge. That is the, not the right button. A did not work. dead? Nope. No, he's dead. Dead. Cool. Oh, good trigger part. I think I need them. I think I need them. I've not had a sip of my tea for 40 minutes. I've nearly let it go it's cold. Right, so... Whereabouts are we going to be? It's not going to be down here, it's going to be left somewhere. We are going to have to fight. There'll be a building up here somewhere. You alright, mate? Lady. Love it. I just one shot him. Okay, yeah, no. Th this area is child's play. Is there a door we can go in? Because that'll probably be it. We can go up this way. Okay, let's go. Fucking hell. I'm not good at this game. I think uh, I think it's the the long and short of this. <laughs> I'm not very good at it. Restaurant. Hello. That looks right, doesn't it? This looks good. I'm sure Kaloon Russell has no interest in such a conventional menu. Is is that something we were looking at? It was. Okay. So looks like we're looking for, like, signs? Menus? Okay. So that's what we were looking for. We're not we're looking for a building. So... Let's go back and see if we can figure out... If we can find a sign on the wall somewhere. Probably the chocolate house, I guess. Where are we going this way? Eh, do you know what? We need the XP. Let's get stuck in here. Ooh, hello. And that's how we did that. We need the XP, so we might as well get stuck in. Okay. So where were we going? Um, we went back the way we came, basically. I don't think this is back the way we came, to be honest. Ooh, you are actually a higher level than me. Let's pin it down. 
Oh, it's off I dodged. Not happy with that, to be honest. Very not happy. Right, you. You're gonna get sucked off. You're gonna get double sucked. I'm gonna double suck you. There you go. So, maximum health. Not quite maximum blood, but we're getting there. Uh, we've taken a wrong turn at some point here. Let's get over the... Oh, we need to go behind... Basically directly behind us. This way. London's a confusing place to navigate. It really is. Ah, there's the gate. Cool. We know where we're going now. Uh, this way. There's the marker on my radar. Right, so, there'll be a sign somewhere on the floor in front of some sort of restaurant. Was this a restaurant? I'm sure I saw one. It'll be the chocolate place. I'm almost certain of it. Looking for signs, looking for signs. Or a menu. Okay, you haven't spawned everything back, have you? No, you haven't. Good stuff, right? Chocolate. Find them. Oh, there's a little board there. The blind Gourmet's menu. A restaurant where the guests are blindfolded before being seated. Intriguing. That's it. Lovely. Report to Calhoun Russell. I wish it was a sprint button. <laughs> oh, there is. It's holding me, not pressing it. Going for a little jog, lads. Don't worry about it. Just going for a jog. All right, Calhoun. Good evening, Dr. Reed. A great night, what? I found an exotic restaurant. I have found a restaurant that could satisfy you, Mr. Russell. The most intriguing and exotic restaurant in London. Really? You have piqued my interest. Where is it? It's a place where you eat in complete darkness and try to identify your meal without anything but your palate. My, oh my, how interesting. It could even be fun to eat a little poisson et fruit that way. <laughs> oh, oh, thank you, Dr. Reed. Please, have this for your research. Why, thank you. 200 shillings. Nice. I may have a look at your goods, Mr. Russell. Let's see if there's anything he's got that I want. I think good parts are good. Good tiny handle part. Let's buy that. Buy them to reinvest the money. Reinvo reinvest the money. Sodium hydroxide. White phosphorus. Willy Pete. All right, there you go. Nice stuff. Investigation succeeded. Beautiful. Right, where were we? Uh, we have more side quests, I believe. This fella. Learn where the notebook was stolen. From Usher Tall Tree by Pruin Agents. Hmm, okay. Right, what have you got? You got a headache. Can I do treatments for headaches yet? I don't know. Either way, I think we need to level up, which means we need to decide who we are munching on. So, when leaving Mam alone, I think. I'm not going to take Avery, because he's looking after Mam. Clarence has got a migraine. We need to learn how to make migraine things before, like, the migraine sufferers die. Uh, Venus Crossley. 
Uh, we're friends with them. We can leave them. They're nice people. Caroline Price. Don't know much about her. Caroline Price, I think they're... I don't know. Calhoun's an interesting fella, but his blood quality's a bit shite at the minute. We can keep him healthy and take him at some point. Charlotte Ashbury. Ah, she's the uh, daughter of Lady Ashbury. We're leaving her alone. Kimura Tado, or Tadao? Don't really know much about him. We need to find out where he lives so that we can have a chat. Louise Teasdale? Nope. James. Charles Jerome Albright. He's the cop. We could munch on him. And the Bakers. They are waiting for someone to take them somewhere. And I think if I was going to take both of these, I'd have to take them both at the same time. Alright, she's on the heel. Xiao Shun. She's a, a grieving widow. Does she have much to live for? Question mark? She's done nothing wrong, so I don't know. I don't feel like we'd be doing the world a favour getting rid of her. The insane priest. Can't get rid of him yet. I have, my mesmerised level isn't high enough. Um, now, Benjamin Palmer, I want to get rid of, but his blood level is fucked. He has got neuralgia, and we need to we need to cure him before we can get rid of him. Hmm. Loretta Swanburne, she's selling a fake cure, but I don't feel like it, she's bad. Petrescu, he's a socialist. We like him because of that, but he hates us now. I feel like leaving the socialists in place. That's a good idea. Now, Cadogan Bates can absolutely go fuck himself. I want to get rid of him. He's a landlord. Oh no, you're fine. Are you? No, yeah, the, the Palmers are fine. They're just street urchins and stuff. Now, this free. If I get rid of Joe Peterson, I would be doing the world a favour. And we could have Harry Peterson get adopted by Barrett Lewis, who's his real father. And I feel like that would be a good idea. It'd only give me 2,400 XP at the minute, but we would be doing the world a favour. Hmm. Clayton Darby is a reporter. He's fine. Christina Popper. What does Christina do again? Oh yeah, she's the um, the the lady of the night. We could possibly we could possibly take her, but we want to get her blood level up a bit. I mean, at least Joe Peterson, we're getting most of it. Anything here? Hmm. Du, 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 du. Don't want to get rid of any of the doctors. Thomas Elwood is just in a constant state of suffering. Thelma, she's a bit nuts. Clay Cox, we could definitely get rid of him. He's a gangster. Rakesh. Now, that would be a big one. He's a doc. He is a doctor. We're in, a middle, in the middle of a pandemic. We don't want to get rid of doctors, but he's currently do, um, stealing from from like corpses. So, you know, you could definitely f embrace him without much or feeling. He's a gun runner. Um, she's going out with him. They're kind of essential staff. These two are just sort of patients. They are romantically involved. They both got PTSD from the war. Hmm. Okay, so the two targets I can see Clay Cox. These two, maybe. These two patients, possibly. Maybe Rakesh. I don't know, though. I don't want to. I don't want to munch on the staff. Right, round here, 
Edwina Cox is the one. So Clay and Edwina are definite targets. These two are fine. He, we've already taken him. He was a murderer. And his mum knew it. And she's now better off because she's adopted him. And he's now better off because she's adopted him. Lovely stuff. Um, Nightingale. Gillingham. I don't know much about them, but they seem normal. These two are fine. Rodney Grader. What does he do again? Don't really know him. Tom Watts and Sabrina, they are the tavern owners. We're going to leave them. Taverns are essential services. Right, so what can we do? Clay Cox, we can definitely get him. Um, Joe Peterson, we can get him. I think we're going to go with Joe Peterson and Clay Cox. That sounds like Good night. <laughs> okay. Um, we'll leave these guys. Mason Swan, but he's fucked anyway. It's fine. Um, I want Cadogan Bates, but we're going to wait for him to recover a bit. Ciao, Sean. It's, it's, it's easy 300 XP, but I just feel like that'd be a bad move. Okay, Joe Peterson, Clay Cox. Edwina Cox is definitely coming with me at some point, but do we go for Rakesh as well? That is that, that's a lot of XP. This 5,000 XP. I feel like taking a doctor out would be a bad move. Right, let's go back to the hospital. So, to go here, we need to go... Basically, follow the main road. Follow the main road. Please, sir. Whether you need to buy something or not, I'm happy to help. So, Clay Cox is at the hospital. Um, the other fella that we're taking out is in Whitechapel. So, once we've done the hospital, we turn left. Cool. I know where we're going. Let's sprint it. Just follow the right the follow the main road. This lady the lady's house. Sorry everyone, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna sprint through lads. Ow, fuck. Wankers. If they follow me all the way here, I will have to fight them. But it looks like they're, they're, we've lost them. Our hospital's over there. Let's go. Could potentially take the the, the veterans, but I feel like that would be a, a crime. A big, big crime. All right, let's get rid of Clay. You're right, Clay, lad. And it, I could have gotten rid of you at the start of the game. Hey, Doc. Let's mesmerize you. Now, before we do that, let's just check and see. Now oh, we're all good. Come with me. All right, where are we where are we going? Going this way. Going into the hospital, apparently. I don't know why I would do this. It's going to be a long fucking walk, this. <laughs> to get to anywhere, like, semi-quiet. Are we taking him up to our room? It's a weird pathfinding going on here. Right, in a back room somewhere. Nice. Fuck you, Clay. 
Edwina sends her regards. I killed, extorted, stole. Now I die. Fuck it. I live the way I wanted. This district will soon suffer the consequences of your action. I have no idea what that what that what those consequences would be, but we'll find out. They're not always negative. We have found. I can't think of a negative action. A negative um, um, consequence from killing him. I can't think of one. I'm sure there will be. Right, we're heading over to Whitechapel. Oh, alright, gents. Watch yourselves! This one of them! Oh, oh Christ! Okay. Get wrecked. Leave them be. Let's go straight into Whitechapel. All right. Go. Lovely stuff. And we are in Whitechapel. Cool. Right, where is he? Where is this prick? Joe, please, I don't have your money. Come on, Barrett, you know the game. You, you again? What do you want this time? <laughs> You're a cunt. <laughs> and we are going to end your life. Um, mesmerise. Let's do it. wonder what this guy's going to say. Because we know that Barrett's going to take care of his boy. Or at least we think we know. We think. We hope. Let's do it. Nom nom nom. Who will take care of him? Was I a good father? Ooh, got a small key. Uh, let's go into... Good evening, Harry. May I come in? Sure. Sure. Is there okay. Okay. Let's go and have a look and see if there's a thing that I can unlock in here that will give us a clue. A small key. Let's head on upstairs. Was there something I needed to unlock? Unlocked. There you go. A perfume bottle. Hmm. Joe's barbed cudgel. Nice. Job refusal letter. Let's have a look at that. Hello, Mr. Patterson. It is my duty to inform you of our refusal to accept your application for a job at the dockyard. I must thank you for the time you have spent at our office explaining the difficulty of your situation with your ill boy and the loss of your beloved wife, but it is also my duty to point out the policy of our company, which expressly repro reproves the employment of former criminals or convicts. Your unfortunate connections with the ill-famed Webber boys have been duly noted. These are hard times, sir, and the Finch and Harper intend to reward the first the candidates who best the small inquiry we like to conduct about our future employees. You have my deepest sympathy, and may God and uh, be with you and your family. Sincerely, R.D. Harper. Lovely. Okay then. So we've embraced him. 
Um, we've got a perfume bowl. I'm going to speak to his son. Is there only pain? Hey, Nick. So, How's it going? May I ask you a few questions? I'm not bothered. What could be worse? Did your father ever hurt you? You and your father have a difficult relationship, Harry. Tell me, did he ever hurt you? No, never. My father can be brutal and rude, violent even, but he never touched an air on my head. What is going on between you two then? It's his job, if you can call it a job. He bullies people. Men and women we know, like poor Mr. Lewis, it's just not right. Sorry, uh, I just want to correct you there. Um, he bullied. Past tense. Although you probably don't know that your father's dead yet. Would it ease tensions with your father if he got an honest job? Because he tried, you know. I can't say. I'd be glad if he dropped his thuggish activities. But I'm not sure it would be enough. Why is that? Sometimes I suspect it's me, Dr. Reed. Or it's this life. It's like I can't find my place. Hmm. Interesting. I wonder if... Have you any recent news of Nurse Crane and her dispensary? Nobody dares to enter the dispensary now. Rumours say the nurse has gone mad. Okay. Medical check -up. Do you need any medical help, young man? I'm feeling okay, I guess. All right. Goodbye, young man. Take care of yourself. Good luck. <laughs> yeah, that was gone. Uh, right, I'm gonna have to ch have a chat with you. Fancy buying something, sir? You never lose your focus, do you? Okay. Th no one knows that is he's dead yet, so. Goodbye for now, Mr. Lewis. I think he's gonna. I think he's gonna take the kid in, and if he doesn't, good quality. If he Come doesn't, on, take a look. Don't be we're gonna suck him off. Right, let's go find a safe house. Hang on, you're the, uh... You're the landlord, aren't you? Mr. I can't Bates. do anything with you yet. Evening, Doctor. Doctor? Ooh, I can mess... Oh, no, I can, but I don't want to, because he's... Goodbye, Mr. Bates. ...absolutely fucked, health-wise. Right, okay. Right, let's, uh, let's find a place to lay low for a while. And level up. Right, I believe the west ends in this general direction. It is. I was correct. I sort of know where I'm going, which is a shock. Right, okay. I'm gonna need you to die. Gotcha. Lovely stuff. Right, we do definitely have a, a safe room up there. That's, I think that might be our house. Indeed. Lovely stuff. Right, refilled all. Let's have a look at our workbench. Treatment for headache. Recipe unknown. We need to learn that. We really do. Um, Swamber Cordial. Recycle it. Holy water. I feel like this can be used. Oh, we can't analyze anything. Arrgh. Annoying. Alright. I guess it's a case of let's level up. Okay. So. Got passive skills and active skills. What do we want? So. This blood cauldron is ridiculously good. We can put more health on? More health is good. More stamina would be very good. So we've got level 5 stamina. Let's get both of those up to like level 7 maybe? Maybe. 
maybe even level eight. Now level seven. Let's get let's let's, let's be balanced about this. Okay, extra health, extra stamina, lovely stuff. Right. I want to get this blood cauldron level almost maxed out. I can't max it out right now, but I'm going to get an extra point in there because that. That's like the, the most hard-hitting thing I have. And on bosses? Ridiculous. Takes a lot more blood, though. So I'm going to need my blood level to go up as well. So let's level that up. Cool, cool, cool. Let's have my blood capacity up. That's going to be necessary. Even more. Let's do it. Cool. Could get that up to level seven, couldn't I? But no, let's let's not let's not do that. Uh, big first increases your blood absorption when you bite. That is probably a good idea. Okay, I've got twelve fifty left. That's twelve hundred. Um. Increases the damage inflicted when you bite. Increases the life regeneration when you bite. Hmm. I think the life regeneration is best at the minute. And that'll be enough. That'll be all of the points that we can spend. Unless there's one for 250 that we can get. Um, we could probably spend some on getting a new skill. But I think we've, we've picked our skills. We're quite happy with it. Unless we can spend points there. No, it's like 2,700 bloody hell. <laughs> okay. So there you go. We are now level 29. Lovely. And that is the level at which the enemies are that we've seen. Right, let's see what's happened. Okay. That district's gone healthy. Good stuff. We still have a migraine to treat and a headache. Merchants have been impacted by my actions, and that can only be positive here. They can only be positive here, because we're not doing anything bad here. Right. We've got one person dead, and the health of the area has gone down. Ooh, okay, so we've got fatigue. We've got neuralgia, we can't treat that fatigue, so we've got two fatigues. Got a cold. Two fatigues, a cold, and two neuralgia. We can't do anything about neuralgia. Play Cox is down. Okay, merchants have uh, been affected by that, but that's not a problem. I think that we, we got away with that one. Yeah, we got. Alright, so two fatigues and a neuralgia. We are going to need to. So three fatigues. Sorry, uh, three fatigues and a cold, four fatigues and a cold, five fatigues and a cold, six fatigues and a cold, six fatigues, two colds, six fatigues, three colds. Right. There you go. So six fatigues, three colds. That's what we need to craft. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, Six. Three colds. One, two, three. Can't do anything about neuralgia or, ne or migraines or headaches. That's a shame. Right. Okay, so we have new weapons. We got a saber and we didn't even, we weren't even using it. Jeez. Okay. A clay's hatchet, which is apparently above this. We've been using this. A sword, man. A freaking sword. Right, can we get this above 140 damage? Can we? It thinks we can, I think. 85, 110, 115. So 155 at level 4. So this is definitely the biggest 
damaging weapon. Stamina use is 25. That's, that's 20. I reckon the attack speed of this is pretty good. The same. It's the same. So actually, we want to be upgrading Clay's hatchet, don't we? Yes, we do. Go for it. Okay. Holy shit! <laughs> Absorb blood points or add free stun points. I don't really need to stun. Absorbing blood is good. I'm going to do that. Enhance damage or enhance handling. So less stamina being used. More damage. Blood absorption or stun. Blood absorption. More damage or less stamina. More damage. It's gotta be. <laughs> Holy fuck! Now that's a weapon. Is that a that's a one-handed, isn't it? Yes, it is. Damn. Okay, now Joe's cudgel is above. This so that's level four. It's got 363 damage. This could have 265, but it's also got to have plus 10 percent. So, what well, plus 20 percent? The 265 plus 20 percent. So 10 percent is 26 plus 26. Well, 26 plus 27, basically. Uh, like an extra. Uh, 62. Next 62 on top of that, so that's B3, 2, 5, 6, 7. 3, 2, 7. Maths! So it's not as good. It would be not as good as Booth's X. But it says it would be more. Five, eight, four. We could do that now. But it's saying that Joe's club would be better. It'd be 400 plus 20 percent in total, which would be 440. Nope, 480 in total. And the axe is, would be. 545 plus. Yeah, the axe is better. Well, the stamina? 30. Yeah, no, the axe is better in every way. And we can we can upgrade it, so we're gonna. Hell yeah! Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Beautiful. Nearly 600 damage. Okay, we have a perfect pump action shotgun. Nice. Um, that's been leveled up to fuck. Good stuff. Um, and we have Charlotte Steak, which is 41 stone. That's 30 and it's a level down. Um, so that'd go. What? Do any? It doesn't actually do anything. Um. Right, okay, so it's 30 stone, and it would do and it'd be 27. There we go, 33, but plus, four, yeah, so that'd be 36 in total. Plus it'd be like 24 stamina? 25? I don't know. That's 27, and that does 41. I don't think it's worth it. I think this is the better one. Hang on, have we not got that yet? Nice. Sweet. Very nice. Okay then. Jobs are good. That does 15. At the moment. So that'd be 35 plus... Three, six, nine, twelve. 
12, so it'll be 12 on top half, 35, it'll be 47. Oh, it take it, it's a lot to use it yeah no forget it this is the good weapon so Charlotte Charlotte steak is what we got so let's equip our best weapons our most bestest weapons so we have yep we've got the big booth sacks and here we have clay's hatchet the one-hander Does so much more damage. We got that. Sweet. Okay. Life is good. We've gone up a level. Right, so we need to go around and heal people. Yes, we do. But we'll do that once we've got ourselves a cup of tea. So we'll be right back. You guys chill right there. And when we come back, we're going to heal. And then we're going to progress the story. Yes. BRB. Yes. 